Bye -bye. Back on payback, but not just for normal paybackness today. I'm here to basically play with a new mod that is available for the game. Now, you may have seen this pop up. It is the Need for Speed Debugged, I think it's called. It's basically made by Gzilla, and what he has done, one of the most significant things, in my opinion, is he has added other races. Now, as you can see, fellow YouTubers will be popping up around the map, as well as other racers that have been in the Need for Speed past and Razor is one of those. Now, unfortunately, Gzilla may have not got the memo, but the Mr. Pantsman Maji, for anyone that really is into Need for Speed, knows that Razor is definitely not the owner of this vehicle. Annoyingly, he's in the M3 GTR, but hey, it's something fun. It basically has changed and replaced a bunch of the other uh, races that you found around the map and made them not really boring. Like, who wants to race bell i'm very clearly under level compared to razor the player so what i'm actually going to do is jump in and make this car a little bit better the main thing i want to do because obviously the car is wrong i am going to play the role of proper razor and basically i'm going to race razor in razors i don't know what modifications i'm going to be putting on body wise because let's be real he doesn't use this mustang generally i do wish that he had his mustang in the game that would be so awesome make a proper return like this now there was actually a cameo of razor in need for speed payback as well you may have actually seen if you watched the let's play of it when it came out on obviously other people's videos you may have seen the razor did have a cameo it was one on an event uh, he was he was under a different name as such. Oh my god, look at these diffusers. I completely forgot how stupid some of the mods are in this game. Uh, it's so good. Okay, put on this exhaust. I as I said, I don't want to properly go out for this because you can't even see the design for one. Hey, look, it's my sister. My main problem was that this car is definitely not up to scratch on performance. So uh, you can now buy on this mod level 18 packs, which help them tremendously obviously i'm going to jump in a bit the 399 race pack you can actually also convert the car to different things uh, i've been playing through this game and i'm flying through it with ease because they give you so much i've been playing it without mods and man <laughs> i've got to find my way to him now because obviously you don't get the proper waypoint markers as you do with the races and stuff but one other mod is i can do this without resetting <laughs> the way it should be. Now, I'm not usually a big fan of these package mods because of the fact the mod comes with a bunch of things I don't want. For example, unlimited NOS. Like, I've, I've never ever wanted that in my life on Need for Speed unless I was some, some hacky modder and I was, when I was five and I wanted to cheat. But overall, the mod does add so much more than it takes away from me, if that makes sense. I mean, the game's already beaten, so why not have unlimited NOS and all these things? This is kind of difficult to navigate. There we go. We're on track to find your mate. Another thing is that the AI has been ramped up to be super, super difficult as well, super aggressive compared to what they are. So it increased the difficulty and changed the vehicles they are in. And then I've been I've been literally trying to complete the game over the last few days or get to this point to where I could just race this one AI. So we're now going to jump into the settings. I don't know if this actually does anything for these AI, but I'm going to put it on hard anyway, just because it may help out a little bit. But Razor... Are you ready? He is 192 right now, but again, they've been made more difficult. I don't know if that's the actual number they are. This is the rookie as well. There's three different levels of it. Razor, outrun number one. Let's go. Whoa. You know, what? I'm not even going to use NOS now because I feel like it's massively unfair to him. So the idea of these outruns, if you haven't done one of these, you basically got to get as far as ahead as possible and get those points to 100. When you get the points to 100, you are the winner of the sim simmer in this case normally i don't know who he is i can't remember the 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 ai's name but i don't care because it's razor razor's back in the game he's not really he's the player the player is back in the game and i'm razor and i'm taking back i'm taking back the m3 gtr that is the objective right here and i've won <laughs> amazing okay well as you can see the original name is shown there slipstream and jake paul is the uh, the friend of of this racer is that that's born over there so i think now they don't spawn again for a little while i think a message did pop up but there was i want to show you the actual event with razor in razor's edge there you go and you get a look at the proper mustang this was such an exciting race because of that alone didn't really have a minute or a cutscene or anything but it was still pretty exciting you may also have noticed one main thing is that it was a uh, drag race event and I'm not in my drag car. I'm in something that isn't a drag car. 
which means I'm probably going to be all of them. Yeah, they're all gone. <laughs> now, I wanted to waste some time while Razor respawns. So here we are. Uh, racing, not Razor, because Razor's not in this, this race. That's a poll. You can now, on this mod, play events with any of the classes of vehicles. Uh, I don't know how well it works. The game may possibly crash. I have uh, had a couple of crashes, mostly during mission events. But honestly, it's pretty stable overall. I'm, I'm quite impressed with how stable this mod is. It doesn't have any issues kind of switching back and forth to having mods and no mods with the save game. And yeah, it's pretty darn good. But I would like to see an iteration of this mod myself where it doesn't give you uh, a, a few things, actually. There's a few things, obviously, that, that are in this mod that aren't really for me like I like the idea of being able to explore everywhere that's great that's definitely for me but what isn't for me is the unlimited NOS uh, there's a lot of improvements but there's actually quite a few need for speed payback mods and I thought building up to the release of 2019 it probably makes sense to give some of these mods a go because this is this is the dream the dream is to have the game continue after Ghost has finished with it with support from the community it's fantastic. Like the, the, having that is the the absolute goal. For some reason, me me Stang feels more like a drift car than a race car in this race. It goes properly sideways. <laughs> That's ridiculous. First place, Razor, Razor, where are thou? Please spawn again. I have some power for you. It didn't crash. Would you look at that? Is he back? Is Razor the man back? None of them are back yet. I need to wait. The game's a bit slow sometimes. Catch up to him with. The unlimited NOS, which is just beyond ridiculous. It tops out and it's still like boost man Maji. I am back. Slam on the brakes. The brakes just not good enough. There we go. Now I don't want to do that race. I want to race you, boy. So he is now 256. Which seems like a very nice number. It's the number of of everything. I password limit for uh your wifi. And uh yeah, a bunch of things. Anyway, round number two, Razor. Are you going to race me properly this time? Are you going to give me give me a battle? Or are you just going to sit there like a baboon and do nothing? I've not even used Moss yet and you still can't keep up with me. What is what is with you? Someone give back that M3 to me. Are you even trying, Mr. Raza? Again, the problem is, if you do go off the cliff, I've done this a few times, in an event, you find the problem that you can't... I don't think there's a respawn button. And thus you get stuck <laughs> off-road sometimes behind a barrier. And yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty difficult. But he's actually keeping up on me on the corners. I feel like I remember that being the case on Payback. The AI is better on the corners. But you're better on the streets. That's how the AI was was, was rubber band. I don't even think there was rubber banding in the game, to be honest. At least for the majority. Obviously, the cops had rubber banding. But oh, cheeky, cheeky, man. How dare you? 70. 30 points to go. Come on. I thought this was supposed to be difficult. We got... We shouldn't have gone 399 to be honest. We should have gone the level that the AI was that time. But, hey. I, how was I supposed to know that? I didn't know. 10 points left. 5, 3, 2, 1. There you go. Razor will return. I should hope he does. Because I definitely want to go against him again. But this does mean, again, that we have to wait for Razor Man Maji to respawn. Which means we should do another event. And what event is better to do on Payback than the loop? The loop, the grind of, the, the loopy grind is what I like to call it. All these cars, look at, look at them. All the three cars there, they all have the uh, twin circle lights. It's pretty cool, huh? Quad circle. Twin? Quad? What would you, what would you call it? And as you can see, the NOS just basically makes you an absolutely overpowered monster. And I believe it is completely unnecessary in every single way. And uh, so is this race, so we'll just speed it up. The final veteran razor is 336. I'm going to spawn back where we were before. Catch up to the M3, which isn't difficult. It's proving to be vastly easier. Hello, sir. We're back. I, am, I have returned to retake the M3 once more. Again, for the millionth time on this YouTube channel. Outrun. Stay ahead. No NOS. And we boost. And we're, we're already passing him. This ain't no competition, Razor. I'm, I'm, I mean, player. It's also the exact same route. They we've been doing the whole blooming video. 
I say the album, the, the, the last time we did it, we did the exact same thing. We, we were quick. We're too speedy. And that's why. <laughs> Should we jump off the cliff? No! No, I'm gonna lose! <laughs> and I can't reset. And I can't get off the cliff. Can I retry? No! No! <laughs> you see, this is where the problems occur. Oh, I lost. He obliterated me. He got 100 points already. Are you kidding me? He's actually just round the corner. We're all right. We can gun again. Come on, Riza. Jeez Louise. Now, there are other uh, versions of these available. There's Eddie, I believe, and Rachel is also in the game. If you would like to see me go against those, make sure to give that like button a big old smash, and I'll be able to do those too. But I thought this should be the, the first one. This is, this is the one you want to see. This is the one everybody wants to see. Razor reclaiming the M3, apparently, against himself. I've done a brilliant job setting up this video, haven't I? I assumed the Razor would put up a bit more of a fight than this. Come on, mate. Easy peasy. Six miles to go. And you can't even keep up with me. And you've got the ability to use NOS, and I have not. I do. We're almost halfway. <laughs> Come on. But these are the mods I like to see. The mods that kind of play on the gameplay to make it a little bit more exciting. Because let's be real. Who wants, again, who wants to go against Janet? The Silver Six person. No. Exactly. That's why even adding, even then adding Jake Paul was a little bit more exciting. Because taking down Jake Paul on that video was a lot of fun. On those videos. Because I tried to milk it. And we're going to finish. Come on. I expected a bit more than that. We're done. It's over. Razor has been defeated. Jake Paul, you're net. I'm not. I'm, I'm kidding. Can't believe he took Razor down. I've taken him down. There he is. Can I race him again? He's trying to run off. Look at it. He's being a chicken. Wait. We can actually just go. Does it? Does it not get rid of them? Can we just go again? I think. Yeah. It's just a replay. Okay. Interesting. Yeah. I would like to see the. In increased difficulty that would be nice though I, I think if we do another one of these we'll definitely just get to the level of the actual racer and now i'm going to use nos to show you what would have happened if i did because this is just <laughs> it's just beyond ridiculous can you imagine the regera or the agera uh, one of them either of them with this nos you just boost away like nothing even happened like nothing ever was. Like Razor don't exist no more. And he never did. But it does get to a point where it just... It doesn't want to even push you ahead anymore. It's like, alright mate, you're going too fast. Alright. I won again. But there you go. That, my friends, was going against Razor. We return. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to smash like. As I said, if you want to see me do the others, let me know down in the comments. But other than that, Payback Mods. It's a thing. Until next time. Peace.